Welcome to Your Best Interviews. My name is Eric Smith. Thank you so much for spending the time with me. I know there's a lot of places you could go for this information, so I appreciate you spending the time with me. If this is helpful, please share with others. Today, what I want to talk about is how to tie a tie. There are a lot of videos on this, so if this isn't helpful, check out others. But I wanted to put this here as a resource. Um, I'm somebody who learned how to tie a bow tie on, on uh, YouTube, and it took me three or four different videos to finally get it correct. And so I'm going to try and do this step by step and really easy. Um, but if this isn't helpful, check out other videos. Um, again, this is just a quick resource in case you never had a work in a job where you had to have a tie or never tied one. That's okay. It's super simple. Um, so I'm going to walk you through it step by step. Start by buttoning the top button. Pull the collar up. Okay. So I'm right-handed. And so... When I'm putting my tie on, I've got my short end on my left side. I've got my long end on my right side, right? So your dominant side is where your longer end should be. And I like to have my short end just a little bit below my breastplate. And then what I'm doing is I'm taking the long end and I'm crossing over the short end, right? And I, I want to do it like right, right, kind of at that, like it, imagine like a V-neck, right? So just maybe a little bit below that. Um, and what I'm doing is I'm taking the long end, so I've crossed it over, I'm wrapping it under, and then I'm taking these fingers and I'm going to trap it over the top. Got it trapped over the top, so it's underneath. And then what I'm doing is I'm taking this and I'm putting it underneath, right through here. So I pull it through and I can just throw it right there. And what you'll notice is what you've created here is a little basket, right? So I can put my finger right through. And what you want to do is once you've got your tie, Underneath is you just want to put it right through the basket and just pull and just gently pull it down. And what you're doing is you want to keep the knot formed while you're pulling through. And you can kind of make sure that you're structuring the knot how you want and you're pulling it up. My knot's a little off kilter, but the nice thing is once you have it tied, you can go in there and you can kind of clean it up underneath. You can hide, you can restructure. And just like that, you have a tie that is ready to go for the interview. And if you don't have it right, if the, if the length is off or if it's not sitting exactly where you want it to, what you can do is pull it out and just adjust your lengths again. So again, my short end, I had it right just below my breastplate. If you need to pull it down a little bit further or maybe pull it up a little bit further so that your long end is going to hang kind of by your belt line. That's, that's sort of where you want to think about it. But once again, I'll show you just one more time. It's easier with the collar up and with the top button done, but you're taking your short end, putting it about right here and just put it right in the center, cross over your longer end, cross it right over. Again, think about a V-neck t-shirt. And then from here, you're wrapping under the short end and then back over. So again, long end, I'm wrapping under, over. And then with what you have, it's probably easier this angle, you're going underneath right here. Put it up here. You've got your little basket. And this goes right down in. Hold the short end, gently pull through, and just form your knot. Just like that. And that is how to tie a tie. Do that a few times. My knot's a little off because it's weird looking at the camera while you're doing this, but do this a few times. You can get your knot exactly how you want it. Um, thicker, smaller, the length exactly how you want it. Um, but that's your approach to tying a tie.